base halo and I believe this is an exfoliating scrub. I don't even need to put any water on this. I go in, I wring it out and then I go over my skin because I'm blemish prone so I like to make sure my makeup, my makeup, my cleanser is really doing its job at breaking down the product and really getting it into my skin. It's so good and then I just clean it with um, just a soap, just a glass of um, my soap and then just go over it. But my skin's really improving once again and my new target was trying to figure out how to get rid of spots without creating a dark mark and I found for me there's actually no way. <laughs> there's no way. There's no way to avoid it. I'm gonna get a dark mark. That's, it just is what it is. Hello guys and welcome to this week's vlog. I can't wait to just get back into things. I'm feeling a lot better. Thank you to everyone that showed love in my last vlog. I was still, you know, getting my feet wet. No, I was starting to, you know, towards the end of my recovery. But now um, I'm limping, I'm walking, I'm getting around. I feel a lot better. I don't have like fatigue from walking um, two steps. So yeah, that's good. I'm glad to be back. And I also want to do a big shout out because I hit 2,000, 200,000 subscribers, which is, I can't thank you guys enough. It's crazy. I never thought I would reach that number, like obviously when I started and it's been nice to like grow and I feel like I've grown gradually. So I've really been able to appreciate and take it in and I've hit like a milestone. I'm so happy. It was my dad that um, messaged me to let me know that I've reached 200k because he was on the mark. My dad, if you know him, well, if you know him on here and in person, he keeps an eye on, on my following count. If I reach a new thousand subscribers, he's always the first to let me know. I won't even be knowing and he'll know. And um, yeah, he keeps an eye out. He's so supportive. I love him. And yeah, he let me know that I reached 200k and he, you know, he gave me some words of encouragement, told me to celebrate. And yeah, I've just been taking it in. It's one of those things where like things are happening so fast and it happens it's like, wow. So I'm glad that I've taken my time to really appreciate it. And I'm so thankful to you guys. Um, I do want to do like a giveaway soon. Probably I want to do like a birthday giveaway. If you know when my birthday is, you'll know when the giveaway is coming. So I want to do a nice big giveaway just just because not really not really for 200k but just because to show my appreciation for you guys and if there's a giveaway you already know it's already um going to be international so yes I'm excited for that but yeah I wanted to say a big thank you and a lot of you guys are congratulating me in the comments and it's exciting it's actually exciting I can't wrap my head around it so I felt my own the biggest appreciation as a content creator for um as a content creator to the followers, supporters watching is definitely just to be consistent. So now that my leg is better, I can actually give you the consistency that you guys deserve. What are we doing today, guys? Um, like I said, I've got two, I haven't really cleaned, organized in two months. So I'm about to show you my wardrobe, which is a bit of a mess. I kind of organized the living area. Okay, guys, this is my wardrobe room absolutely chaos we have laundry we have pr we have more laundry and yes we are going to organize it but first i'm gonna i'm gonna eat because i need i need all the energy i can get okay guys it's a new day once again I feel like I'm like my makeup videos well my makeup videos my vlogs these days are just me without makeup on my day sorry let me show you my crocs you guys like my crocs I've joined the croc gang um I'm never going back I love them so much um I know they're ugly but that's okay I've been influenced my friend Tommy do you guys remember um my uh, girls night in I did it well it was on TikTok and my friend Tommy came in and we called it like Miss Croc O'Clock because yeah she came at like eight it was like Croc O'Clock and yeah I was like laughing at them at first and I was like you know what I'm jumping on the bandwagon so yeah she definitely influenced me anyway 
what are we doing today i'm getting my hair done i just need to get it all back um my braids for the wig that i showed you guys in the last uh, clip uh, my my braids are basically sticking up because they're so bulky so i'm getting them actually properly done um, i'm just gonna go to somewhere nearby get them done get my nails done because they're so outgrown and i'm seeing my friends tiffany and Mon also going to show you my wardrobe well it's not done it's nowhere near done but at least my room is way more organized still not perfect but it's fine i don't need it perfect but yeah my hair wow um yeah my appointment isn't for another 30 minutes and yeah it's right by me so i've got some time to kill what else can i show you guys obviously we are going to be doing a haul um let's do it tomorrow should we do it tomorrow yeah let's do it tomorrow i'm gonna just try on some bits we'll do a haul i'll show you guys some pr that i got i'm just so happy that my house is nice and clean i still need to like i don't okay number one ade obviously was taking care of me you guys know oh my gosh nigerian man to, to the core he got me this big ass <laughs> rice like i make rice this often he got me the massive Big, big rice, and he got me, like, well, he didn't get me contained. These are his, these really need to, oh, this is mine. I'm gonna put that back in my seasonings drawer, uh, cupboard. Yeah, I don't know where to put this. <laughs> it's rice. Really and truly, my kitchen is just not really, it's not made, my kitchen is not made for cooks. Let's put it that way, it's not made for cooks. Um, and I've got this big ass rice. We, you know I don't be cooking like that for me to have this big ass rice. It's longer than my torso. Um, where am I gonna put it? Um, to be honest, we made good use out of it. But damn, I don't know. It's, it's not gonna be on show. That's for one. One purple ass. No. Oh, I wish I could ask you guys for some help. Um, yeah, my story. My storage. The way they've done it up here, I don't really like it. Like the cupboards, they have cupboards, but they always have like shelves in the cupboards. So it's like, I can't put something as big as this in somewhere, um, anywhere. I promise you I'm not having it on show. And I don't have grass like that. Um, you know what? No. I need to stand it up so the grass doesn't go anywhere, you know? Okay. We've got it inside. I just shoved it. Let me show you guys. I just shoved it. This is my cupboard of whatlessness. Because what is even going on here? Anyway, get my hair done. I'll probably talk to you guys um, when I'm back from getting my nails done. Let's, let's cut to a little snippet of me on the go. Uh, guys, we're in a bit of a pickle. I forgot to bring my wig with me so i'm going to be doing my hair and it's for wigs for braids like underneath my wigs and i have no wig so huh, everyone's just gonna have to appreciate that i'm going to be wearing a hood all day today just taking off the glue off the wig like I said my wig my braids are way too bulky to go underneath um, this wig it covered it well but oh if I put my hair up you'll just see my big ass, ass fro in the back just taking up the space so I'm just wiping off the glue but I'm just gonna wear a glue loose today um, yeah we're gonna go see my friend Mon just gonna chill at her some wine catch up get some probably get some nando's and just chill um i'm so excited like for me my friends and family keep me going i'm, I'm not even joking to you like i need to see them at least once a week if that's if yeah no i need that i need that i need the dose 
I feel like it's so important, especially when life is busy and chaotic. I feel like I like having my friends and family around because they ground me, they motivate me, not without even trying. It's not like they pour into, well, they do pour into me, but it's not like they're saying anything, but just being around them is just like, you know what? I see how hard they work and how, how what's it, busy they are, their lives, and it's like, listen, everyone's, everyone's busy, everyone's working. So I get my ass up and go. I think my favorite for me, like a good week for me, it's, um, obviously on top of my work of course um, putting out organic content for you guys to watch and enjoy. Um, seeing seeing my friends seeing Ade and maybe like a nice relaxation dig like it's nothing serious I don't need to go out and party like I don't enjoy it unless I'm surrounded by the people I love so that's the only time I actually like going to events if I'm surrounded by the people I love other than that, of course work and um, stepping out of my comfort zone those are the only two reasons I really go out tomorrow tomorrow I actually ordered um, Zara products because I saw on TikTok that Zara releasing beauty like foundations and stuff and I've heard good reviews so far well i've only watched one tiktok let me not lie and she promoted it really well I'm, I'm gonna do like a review on it so i think that might be my next video just so i can have like a really long vlog for you guys let me just slap this wig on my head oh very chaotic okay let's adjust it Okay, we need to wet it and make it look cute. I just do that by putting water and mousse and comb it and then I will be out the door. Actually, let's do some perfume. What am I gonna wear today? Um, I'm going to wear, oh, I'm gonna mix. I'm gonna mix Sol de Janeiro, that, the brand, you know, the Bum Bum Cream? This is it, and I'm gonna mix it in with Maison Francis Gentle Fluidity. I think like these would go really, really well together. I recently bought the Soul um, fragrance. Um, what would I say it smells like? Sweet, it smells like the Bum Bum Cream, but like um, in perfume form. I love it. I wore it um, to Ade's parents' house for Mother's Day and um, his sisters were complimenting me both. I was feeling myself and I was just wearing that. So yeah, I really like it. It smells like, like sweet, rich warmth, but mixed in with like a popcorn smell. Don't be alarmed. It's really nice. I can't describe it. Anyway, I really like it. Let me go sort out my hair. Okay, it's very simple. Um, in fact, Chrissy taught me because I went to a mask class the other, the other day. Well, I'm always her muse, but I've been taking tips from her. I'm like, okay, she's taught me so much about how to lay a wig and do this and do that. This is all you'll need and water. And I've got a loose wave on right now. Loose wave wig. Water, water my hand and then get the mousse. And then we're just gonna go over it. Adding water to, just gives it some life, you see? You see the difference? This is the ORS uh, mousse. Just getting quite a bit of that one. And if you really wanna define the curls, take the comb. I usually use my fingers, but because I've had this in a drawer, it's quite tangled. And this hair sheds very, like, barely. Only if I'm really combing it aggressively like this, but it doesn't really shed. Okay. Let the no parting look. Let me cut to when I'm just ready and out. guys i'm listening to um shay universe she's a 
She's British, she's from the UK, she's Nigerian, she's an artist, like an R&B, UK, I absolutely love it. Um, she's got a new EP out, it's called Unorthodox. I will link it down below, I've been listening to it all morning, I absolutely love it. It's not too long, it's, it's literally 20 minutes long, but it's like a nice vibe, it's got about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 songs. It's a nice vibe. Um, that's how I started my Friday morning. Happy Friday. Anyway, um, last night, oh, last night was so much fun. Um, we got to see my friends, we chilled, we talked. We were even meant to grab food. We were just talking so much that every time we go to order, we get distracted again. Can you imagine? And I hadn't eaten all day. I hadn't eaten all day. And I was just getting distracted. Every time I'd go, like she, um, my friend would go to order, Nothing. A, a friend to go to order, get distracted in a conversation. I go to order, get distracted in a conversation. And it happened like a good four times. To the point where it was like 1am. I was like, okay, we're not eating tonight. Let's just go home. Because every time we try, it just doesn't work out. But no, that's how fun it was. Anyway, um, today is a new day. Uh, what have I got to do today? On my Instagram yesterday, I actually mentioned that I'm looking for a personal assistant and I actually said what I needed and um, a bunch of people hand gave me their, uh, hand, or emailed me their CVs and everything and so far I'm really really impressed with everyone that's messaged me so I'm so excited they came correct CV perfect top tier exactly what I'm looking for they just get it I was afraid to put someone that knew me because I'm bringing you into my life and it's a bit you know I'm breaking down the walls but I think it's even better because it's like they know me they get me they know what I'm like and they can find the gaps of me that they can fill in so it's, it's even better than I thought it was because um, from other influences I got told like listen go go with someone that has no idea of you and that's, that's also good listen I'm, I'm gonna still keep, bear that in mind but I also want someone who who knows who's interested and can provide that's what I'm saying the CVs are very much tailored to what I'm looking for so it's great anyway I'm going to read through all of them, get back to everyone, and I'm probably going to do some interviews next week. I'm so excited. Also got brioches. Brioches are so nostalgic for me. They are my... My mum used to get these, like, loads of them. I think they are from either Costco's or Tesco. They're just an easy, like, snack. Mmm. They taste good. I got sick of them because my mum had them. We had them so much when we were growing up that I got so sick of them. But now I like them with my coffee. Nice little snack. And I'm not too hungry. When I'm not too hungry, I like a brioche. Hello guys, I'm back. My makeup's done. Um, I just had to do a quick... Uh, it's like a stories for um, Iconic Brow. No, not Iconic Brow. Iconic London for their brow products. Stunning. What was it? Um, I use this brow pencil as well as um, <laughs> a, a brow like setter very much like the refi one although it does dry down quicker than the refi one the refi one takes uh, longer to dry and then this pen a uh, pencil it has like one marker side I'm not sponsored to say any of this by the way I've already done I've already done my part <laughs> um, a pencil and then a spoolie, so you get it all, all in one. I was like, oh my God, I like this. I'll happily promote it. Um, I'm gonna get some food. My foot is starting to hurt and I was meant to get content today, but my foot is hurting. Um, if you guys don't know, I'm like recovering from short toe surgery, basically my fourth toe. I had to stretch out, um, break a bone, put a metal plate in there, break a bone from my heel, put the bone into my foot and then put a metal plate on top. So yeah, they say like the recovery is like 12 weeks. And I've really been trying to get my feet. It's been like two months and I've been trying to get my feet because it's the 1st of April, new month. And I got my, my surgery was on the 1st of February. So it's been like two months. So I can walk on it, but if it gets too, if my foot starts to hurt, I try not to push on it because I want my foot to heal well. So I might just have to go a bit later when my foot's rested and get grab some quick, what is it with my appetite these days? I might get a Vapiano because I haven't truly eaten in two days. 
No, I had a brioche today and I had a croissant. That's the only thing I ate yesterday. I was literally go, 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 go. Yeah, so let me actually digest something. Uh, yeah, because when I'm like having, when I'm truly having a productive day, I just forget to eat. What am I gonna get from Vapiano's? I like the gambaretti uh, with spinach, like spinachi. <laughs> but um, it's just a bit too filling, but it tastes so good. I'm gonna have that. Watch some Bridgerton, relax for a little bit because I've got my main priorities out of the way. I also answered um, everyone's emails for their, um, for the role of a personal assistant. And now I can breathe for a little bit. It's not even two o'clock, yay me. And then we move again. <laughs> Goodness. What is it truly to admire a woman? I need to go shoot content, so I can't even go through the PR right now. Um, PR clothes that I bought. No, I'm really cold. Oh, okay. Um, you know what? I bought something from Zara. What a few things from Zara. Oh, is it the dress I got? Like a, I bought like summary pieces. Oh, actually, I think I'm gonna wear this today. It's like an open top. Oh, it's really giving breasts, isn't it? Like that. Okay, this is an option. What else did I get from Zara? I will try everything on um, probably tomorrow. Oh, is my dress showing? Anyway. What is this, honey? What else did I get? Oh, simple green tank. Cute. Oh, I could wear this with this, these trousers. I'm gonna even show you these trousers, I really like them. And then I got a shirt. Oh, I could wear this as well. Um, if I could be, ooh, what is me with like long necks? If I could have been bothered to, why'd I get? Oh, yeah, I got me new. Am I gonna iron now? Okay, right, got that. I'll track these on tomorrow, like I said. And then I got a nice simple dress because I really thought it was gonna be spring, but it's cold as hell. I like these little beads, it's giving summer, spring, summer. I really like these trousers, they're from a brand called Rotate. To be honest, I did get these taken in. I got these like taken in a little bit more because the um, crotch was very low, I didn't like it, so. Got taken in, I really like these. I'd wear them for with heels if I was leaving, and but today it's like a cute, easy vibe. Top is from New Look. Um, really like this top, and slippers are from the Londoner, but I stole them. Let's figure out what am I going to wear. It's cold. I don't know what to wear. I don't know what to wear. I don't know what to wear. I have to wear my outfit with flats. I'd have outfits if I could wear heels, but I have to wear flats. Okay, give me a second, I'll be back with an outfit. <laughs> okay, outfit of the day. First of all, let's start from top to bottom. I got these trainers. Everything is from Farfetch. I was gonna show you guys all of this in my haul, but I might as well just start off with like the main pieces that I bought. So these are from Farfetch, got them from Stadium Goods. Ah, these, all oh, these Jordans. These Jordans, absolutely gorgeous. I don't know the name. They will be of course linked down below. A pricey pair, but I had to have them. I was just like, this, I'm a neutral babe, so I need some neutral trainers and I haven't really bought trainers in a minute. So that's gorgeous. And then I got these Balenciaga jeans. Um, this outfit is an absolute splurge, but I, I love it. It's got these cutouts at the back. It's like boxes. But it's like, you know what? It's quite cool because also the bottom of my trainers, they look like they're lubes, but they're definitely not. 
So I've got these like boxes kind of thing underneath, which I'm glad because it doesn't actually show my ass and I don't want my ass on show. So I've got that in the back. Doesn't really match the rest of my outfit, but it's okay, it's from the back. It's none of my concern, as far as I'm concerned. Um, I got these in the size 30. Definitely should have gone like a 29, maybe a 28, but it's okay, I can get them tailored because I like the fit. It's just they're a bit, um, definitely a bit bigger the waist. And then I've got this bomber. Gorgeous bomber from Sakai. It's so light, this is not gonna cover you at all. In fact, I'm bringing a hoodie with me and a scarf because I know it's cold out in London today and I'm not about to be shivering, but I need to get my content and I need to, I need people to see me in this fit. They're so cute. And then I just got a Skims like body underneath. Body, just Skims top. Skims basic top. Um, I thought it went really nice with the colors. And then a YSL baby. Yep, I'm about to see Joe. Ah, I feel I feel super cute in this fit. Not me back outside. It's really giving low waist. My stomach is so out. And my makeup. My makeup, I definitely need to do a haul. Anyway, let me book the Uber and be on my way out. See you guys in a sec. Mwah, bye. Hello guys, I'm back from taking um, content. Uh, sorry that I didn't show you guys because I was taking it on my phone and I didn't actually bring my vlog camera with me because the area we took pictures in, you really shouldn't be taking pictures of, so I don't want to bring too much attention to us. Um, but I'll show you guys the pictures I took, they're right here, I really like them. Um, you know, I'm like, I feel like my fit didn't trans well, translate well on camera. Like, it's not bad, but I just didn't love it. I loved it in the videos, I did a reel, uh, that should be up by now as well. I'll leave that there. Um, but I just feel like my track, my fit didn't translate that well. But I know it was, it was good. No one could tell me different. Um, personally. Anyway. Oh, my necklaces always get tangled. I need to get those um, things that at the back to keep like my necklaces from getting tangled. Because this is like an ick of mine. Oh, whilst I do this, I'm very excited to take my makeup off. I'm going to show you guys what I'm doing for my dark marks. I spoke about on um, Instagram, but I want to give you guys a tea on what I'm using um, so far. Still got a long way to go before I can really give like an approved review. That's I'm really waiting for my skincare reviews, skincare video. I'm like, why do you guys want me to rush a skincare video if my skin is not where I want it to be yet? You know, I can't, I can't guarantee the product's going to be good. I want to wait. I want to wait. Oh, I did it. This, this necklace is from Idol. I did a brand collab with them a while, um, a few weeks back. It's a get ready with me, love it. I just love how it sits on my collarbones and it's just right there and there might be a necklace from a jewelry. So pretty, anyway. Let's take off my makeup. I also recently got a, what is it? Is this called like a butterfly clip? A class butterfly clip? Cause I need them, especially when doing my makeup. But because I wanted to do like tapings and micro um, links, I wanted to do this hairstyle, but I don't know. Every time I see someone with taping and micro links, I just feel like their hair breaks. I feel like, the, especially the front of the hair, like I'll be damned. I grew up my hair all this time for me to have like breakage at the front. No, I'm scared. Anyway, my lace is definitely lifting. If you see that, no you didn't. Uh, what do I want to start off with first? How about we go in? Try guess what I'm about to use. Try guess. Try guess. If you guess Elements Pro Collagen, you are correct. Cookie for you, a medal for you. Um, just take a lot dog. Can't wait to get into bed, watch some Bridgerton, uh, maybe to speak with a friend. Um, yeah, and then wake up tomorrow. Tomorrow's dedicated for my haul, my PR haul. I just knew today it was just a bit manic and I knew when I came back from getting content, I'm always tired when getting content. The day is always done for me. Like I can't just get back unless I have a nap. It's just physical, you know, physical labor. Ah, I've got makeup in my eye, in my eye contacts. I just washed my hands, I'm gonna just take it out. Oh, yuck, yuck, I had a lot of makeup. So I need to, once I get all the makeup off, once I really get it out, I then go over everything with 
face halo this is an exfoliating scrub it's gentle but you know it still exfoliates i just wring this out with water probably some nice warm water it doesn't need to be hot or anything just nice and warm and then i just go over the skin but this is before i do my double cleanse literally you don't even need product with it you just use it we massage that in like it just gets that like extra makeup off before going in with a double cleanse just to wipe it all away and I usually go around areas where I get blemishes so I would get some of my eyebrows, my forehead and my chin and then pull areas where like makeup likes to be trapped in like my nose I feel like it then my cleanser works better because I've got an exfoliated base um, I love the deep cleanser by Elemis um, I feel like this gets like the gunk in the eyes, it gets like the gunk like when I say gunk like I, you know sometimes you can get eyelash glue in your eyes, nasty, I hate it, it's like a pet peeve when I see that on myself or other people, I like instantly just want to go and clean it out myself, but yeah, it's usually like on a night out and then you wake up in the morning with like gunk in your eye, it gets like that. Definitely use a non-fragranced uh, cleanser afterwards because the more gentle the cleanser is, the, the, you know, you've just, had an, you've just had an exfoliation, so your skin is like open. So you wanna use something gentle on top. Once my base is nice and clean, I go in with the Caudalie Vino you know, Pure. This is a toner, oldie, goodie, you guys know. And I just kind of go over. And it's got salicylic acid, so it's good for your, it's good for your babes. And then, and then I get some retinol skin booster for my skin. Push that in. This really gives me a glow, I absolutely love it. And then a new product that I've been really liking is the Ordinary Ascorbic Absor Acid. I hope I'm saying that right, but I heard this is really good for dark spots. So I legit use like a pea sized amount, maybe two drops. And then I just apply that to the areas where I have dark marks on my chin and my forehead are like the main places. I don't really put it around my face because I don't really have dark marks, just my chin and forehead. And then vitamin C, uh, vitamin C um, gel moisturizer. This is by Dermalogica. It's gonna help brighten the dark marks. This is heavy duty skincare because I've done a full face and I need to give my skin some TLC. Then the new product that I've been trying out is a Caudalie again, Vino Perfect. This is the dark spot correcting high uh, glycolic night cream. So just take a little bit. But yeah, this is what I've been using. I can't guarantee everything, but so far, no spots and my dark marks um, seem to be improving. My skin looks really good, so let's see. I always forget this is heavy duty, but it's cool. It's cool because I need that. Like it is, we have to blend this in. Oh. But I like that because I've been using heavy products and acidic, you know, the exfoliator stripping my skin so something heavy on top is great the glow the glow all right let me brush my teeth actually no i'm about to have some popcorn whilst i watch bridgerton i'll brush my teeth when i'm done anyway see you guys in bed <laughs> So good to be alive. Got everybody by my side. It feels so good to be alive. Got How does the song go? By Beyonce. Guys, I promise you, if I could sing, you lot would not hear the end of it. Oh, I'd be on. I'd be insufferable i really would how does the song go 
Oh, got all my family by my side. It feels so good to be alive. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm just so shocked. I heart off what that sounded. Ooh. Anyway, maybe it's the fatigue. It's the fatigue. I'm tired. I'm tired. <sighs> oh, I've got my popcorn. I have to have my leg elevated, but oh, having my TV. It's made me snack more in bed, which is really bad. But to be honest, it was a day that in, like, not encouraged, influenced me because I realized that like, men, uh, most men have a TV in their bedroom and women don't. Like, I really didn't before like, I met a day. I really didn't really, like, I just watch things on my laptop and like Ade cannot watch things on the laptop. You cannot, so it made sense to get a TV. And now I've got a TV here. I'm like, you know what? I fully understand. Like I just I can't go back to watching things on laptops. Even though I can, I prefer a nice screen, get comfortable, cozy, sat like this. And I can just look up into a big screen rather than looking into a small screen. Anyway. Got my popcorn of choice sweet always i feel like salty just makes my lips just a bit ugh. i don't like that feeling that salty gives like i like the taste i just don't like how my lips feel after because i guess i lick my lips a lot i really need to put my retainers in have you got i have not put them in at all basically i accidentally i put them in tissue because i didn't have my case and then the waitress at the restaurant took my uh, tissue and put it in the bin. And that was about a couple of days ago. And I had just started that one. So I was like, I can't just go on to another trip. It's going to be so painful. And then I delayed it to the point where it's so painful to put them in. Especially the bottom row. The bottom row um, Invisalign trays are always the most uncomfortable. I need to suck it up. I need to suck it up. My journey's going great. It's been going great until the woman um, accidentally. Of course, it's not her fault. It's my fault. I should have had a case. Through my case away. You know, I've just been raggedy ever since. I'm going to start tonight. I feel like if I'm going to put them in, I need a sleeping pill. Honestly, it's that painful. Okay, I'm gonna watch Bridgerton. I'll see you guys soon. Oh, the new Rema album. I love it. Anyway, let me stop the music. So, we have a lot of packages to get through. I don't know if you guys can see all of them. Um, yeah, you guys said last week you guys want to see some PR. So I've got a few from brands I really love. Um, let's look at what I got. Um, it's like an accumulation of like a couple weeks, maybe a month. Oh, my favorite is from, this is from Huda Beauty. Oh, I see color. I see color. Oh, these are gorgeous colors. Okay. And a brush. Oh, is this blush? <laughs> it's blush. This is a cheek tint blush stick. Oh, I'm gonna use this today. I'm gonna use this today because these colors, divine. These colors are divine. Let's open one I think I'm going to wear today. I love this coral cute color. This is exactly the color I'd have on my cheeks. Okay. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm gonna try this on today for, for you guys. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna film a TikTok or a reel. I think I might film a TikTok. Anyway. Ah, thank you, Huda. Love them. Oh, cloud pink. Sorry. This is also a color I'd wear. Ah, these are gorgeous blushes. Oh, it's like shimmery. Um, this looks exactly like um, Nars Orgasm. Very much Nars Orgasm. 
Oh, these shades are very pretty. It's very much like a highlight sun. I think I feel like if I've got a tan, this would look really, really nice. Um, I should have brought baby wipes. Let me get baby wipes so I'm not smudging on myself. Oh, I did a big order at Glossier. It's been a minute. I stopped, I topped up on some products that I've, uh, you guys know I love. And I also got some new things, I believe. If you guys know me, I love Glossier for a long time. And then I just, I just, I don't know, just casually just stopped buying from them. No reason. It's just, I think there was just so many products. There's always so many products out there. So I just kind of tried some new stuff. But... I do find like my skin was at its best as well as like makeup when I was using Glossier. So I bought quite a bit. So we've got some more cream blushes because you guys know I'm obsessed. Is this cream blushes? Yes, it is. Oh no, these are lip balms. They had like three for um, three for two, I believe. So these are the lip balms. This is a new one. This is a new one. No, Cookie Balm. Dot com. Oh my god, I'm gonna try it. The birthday balm smells really good. They smell really, really good. I can't remember if they taste good, but I just know they smell good. They're really moisturizing lip balms. I just stocked up on makeup because I haven't bought makeup in a minute. Let me try. Let me smell. This is the cookiebutterbalm.com. We shall smell this. I don't. I hope it doesn't smell like peanut butter. If it does, I'm gonna sell it. Sell it or give it away immediately to like one of my friends' fam. Oh, it legit smells like a cookie and it's like a brown chocolate phase. Oh, it smells so good. I want to eat it. Does it leave a colour? That's what I want to know. Oh, it smells so good. It smells so good. It legit... I just got it everywhere. It smells like um, a cookie. Like a good cookie. I'd have no idea how this looks. Okay, not bad. Oh, so that's fine. Not too fluid. Lovely. Then I've got obviously you've got cherry and a birthday balm. Birthday balm smells like birthday cake. This this smells good. And cherry, I believe it smells like cherry. I haven't tried this, but it's got a little bit of a tint. It's like a reddish tint. So that would be really nice on the lips. Next I've got some skincare. Ah my holy grails. Ah. This is what, like, my when I was really going on my skincare journey, these are the first product, products I actually ever really use, which are the Trio Skin, ooh, which are the Trio, and um, these are the Trio Super Pure, they're the serums, basically, Glossier serums. One's for glow, one's for um, blemishes, and one's for hydration. I love these products, really, really love them. I love them as primers, I love them as skincare. Um, my favorite, if I had to give you one, I'll give it to you in top to bottom in my favorite order. Let me get them out. So my favorite is the Super Pure. It's got, um, oh, I don't know how to say this. Is it Neosinamide? Cinnamide, Neosinamide and Zinc Serum. Uh, this is good for Usually, it used to say what it was good for. But it's good for blemishes. I found it was good for blemishes for me. Oh, I love this. It's so good. I started this years back, probably when I was about 18. And it's just been good to me. It's been really good to me. Never had a problem, never had an issue. When I stopped, I think I had so much of it that um, in my, my cupboard, when I finished all my top-ups, it just kind of just stopped. But I've missed it, so I've added it back. And then I love the Super Glow. I really, I really like the Super Glow because it's got vitamin C as well as magnesium serum. So it's really gonna help brighten the skin, especially for like dark marks. So I like this for that. And I also like, and then we have the Super Bounce. Now this has hyaluronic acid and vitamin B. This is for people that want some hydration to the skin, for rough skin. And, and I like to pair these two up, Super Bounce and Super Glow together as a primer when I'm doing my makeup. I like a little bit of my skin, skin prep. I really like these products. Oh, I've missed them. Also, I picked up the Future Dew Oil Serum. This, now this, I would say that I don't really need it right now, more so winter time. And more so if I wanna wear no makeup and just have a super glow to the skin. Look at the packaging. I really like it. And then you just apply it. And then it's just gonna give you that shine, baby. It goes 
right into the skin. So, no serum, serum. No serum, serum. It's really good. And I've got a combination to oily skin, but I just find that it doesn't bother like my oils, oil. I don't end up looking too oily. Love it. And I love it as a primer. And then I picked out the Skin Exfoliating Skin Perfector. Now I've never tried this. Um, I've heard mixed reviews about this. This is Exfoliating Skin Perfector. Uh, it says use once a day after cleansing, press on a cotton pad on top dispenser and sweep across face and allow a moment for the solution to absorb into the skin. I will tell you how this goes, but I was like, I like it. And it's got AHA, 10%. I'm interested to see how this works. So I've been really into my skincare these days. What else did I get? Oh, I got the uh, Glossier U perfume. I really like this perfume. If you guys watched my very first perfume collection, you guys know that I mentioned this, which is the Glossier U perfume. I really like this. It's literally just the most subtle you but better fragrance. I like the body chemistry. I feel like it always smells different on every person and I like how it smells on me. It smells nice, clean, fresh, and I wear it during the day. I, I have to wait for it to sit on the skin for a second. But I like it. It's not, it's, it's not loud at all. It's for those subtle people that do not want to bring too much attention with their scent. They just want to smell good. But it's like a nice, when you catch a whiff of it, it's nice and, it's nice and musky, fresh, um, quite warm. But it doesn't draw too much attention, which I really like. And then I also, anyway, that is everything I got from Glossier. Oh, these are my favourites. Um, okay, before we do my, my haul or my try and haul, what else did I, what else is this? I think this is PR. Links for everything will be down below, of course, babe. Oh, is this Benefit? Oh, what have we got here? This looks like the bright under eye tint. Oh, is it tint? Is it a concealer? Is it a tint? Because I have the concealer. I really like it. It's really nice and bright. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a brightening under eye concealer and then liquid coverage concealer. Oh, so it's got a brightener as well as a concealer. This looks really good. Um, I have the concealer. I will, this is what it looks like. Because you guys know I love the Airstick foundation. That's like my only bronzer that I use on my face. And then concealer. Oh, if you want that bright under eye, look at this. Look at this. This is in the shade 6.5. I would say this is like a um, closer to, I'd say 340 for Fenty. If you like a really bright under eye. Fenty is like a closer shade match. Or... I'd say it's like a ginger by NARS. Yeah, if you like those shades, you'll, you'll like this shade. Okay, oh, I'm excited. Okay, I'm also gonna include this in today's makeup tutorial. I'm gonna use all these products. Thank you, Benefit. Okay, this is from Estee Lauder. I'm excited, I love Estee Lauder. Is it skincare, is it makeup? What is it? Oh! Oh, thank you, Estee Lauder. Oh my gosh. I've got a double wear. Um, this is the foundation as well as a sheer foundation. We've got two. Okay, we're going to try this out today as well. Oh, I'm excited. Okay, okay. Oh, and the primer and a, I think this is like a bronzer. <gasps> this looks really good. Thank you. Okay, this is a bronzer. Oh, this looks good. The packaging is just stunning. Ah! Oh. Oh. Look at that. I do think that these shades... This looks a little light for me, though. Does it? Does it not? Maybe not. Oh, oh. Just a little too light. Just a little too light for me. Mm, I think it's a little too light and a little too neutral. But I just know if it was my shade, it would really do the job. I just think if you can see the jaw compared to like my neck, it's just a little too, there's like a pink undertone. But now that I see this, I need to go find my shade. 
I need to go find my shade. Now that I see this, I need to go find my shade. So thank you so much. This shade is 5W1 bronze. So maybe I'm like a six, like a little, I'm a little deeper. Oh, this concealer looks like it will be really good though. Sorry, I'm like playing with my face already before I've even done my makeup. I'm actually going out with my friend tonight. My friend Nicole, you guys will see her. Um, we're gonna go out for drinks, little shisha. Just have some fun. Okay. Oh, this looks like it's really good though. This looks like it's like my shade. Especially for correcting. Um, what else should we correct? I just want to use everything I use today for a makeup tutorial. Because why not? I want to try out new products. My battery's full! Okay, my memory card's full. Okay, I'm going to come back. Ah! This is good! It means loads of footage. <laughs> I think that is everything from PR I've got recently. Oh, actually. Am I lying? Oh, okay, this is something I bought. Sorry, it's right behind me. It's from Harvey Nichols. So I saw Love Cast. She's an influencer on uh, YouTube. You guys know her. You guys have seen her on my vlog. That's my girl. She was raving about this perfume that I've actually had on my list. It's, is it called? I don't even have to say properly. The Lena Exclusive. This is the fragrance. Oh guys, the packaging, I just had to get it. I wanna say if Maison Francis a la Rose, if you smelt that, it smells similar to that, but imagine it with a bit more warmth. Or, oh, it smells like, ah, I can't think of a, of a scent that, there's nothing really like this. This is why I bought it, because Kaz was saying the same thing. What would she describe it like? Anyway, I'm going to leave my proper true description after I do some research and try this out for tonight because I'm going to wear this tonight. But yeah, definitely a bougie scent, but I haven't actually splurged on, on a fragrance in a minute. Last time I splurged was, I believe, November. And we're in April. I think that's really good for me anyway. I did a big makeup shop at Zara. I won't get into everything I got because I did a YouTube review, but I will just show you. Actually, no, I'm doing a YouTube review, so I want my first impressions to be very real and true. I'm doing a long wear makeup review of this, so by the time this vlog goes up, then soon after will be my perfume collection as well as a Zara perfume review. And I also got batteries because I bought a film camera. I got batteries for my film camera. I'm gonna go get my film camera, I'm very excited. I've got my film camera, I bought this on Depop. Um, this is super cute, it's like an Olympus film camera. My, my friend Mon has one and she's been able to capture the best pictures and it's so fun whenever she like gets them printed and like, sends them to the group chat to all of the girls, we can all see what she got. Oh, we can all see the pictures back. And I've been getting like um, disposable ones from Kodak on Amazon, but I just thought like it's just a bit of a waste of money just to keep buying disposable cameras when I can just buy a film camera. And it's super cute. Okay, let me... Let me put my battery in and take a picture. My first picture. My room's a mess because all these boxes. What are we gonna take it anyway? Uh, right, where's my scissors? I'm gonna stop trying to open things with my nails. I'm so cute. I'm gonna, have, I'm gonna have to remember to take this camera with me everywhere. Because I want all the memories I can get this summer. Yeah, you have to get batteries with this. I need some batteries soon. I've got these this from Amazon. Ooh, I've got loads though. This, this camera's gonna be with me for a while. Let us. I think I'm ready. Yay! Oh my God, here we go. I think I did it. I think I just had to put the roll over because I got a roll in the back. Ah! That was fun, okay. Oh, I'm gonna put it away now. Ah! Okay, <laughs> I've got a film camera. Um, okay, let me organize this mess and then we'll get to the tram haul. Sorry, that has made my day. <laughs> I know you guys absolutely hate me, but I'm running late and I need to get my makeup. Well, my makeup, mm, is it kind of done? It looks like it kind of is done, but I need to make a move. I've got to see my friend um, Nicole in a bit, so I'm going to do my makeup. Shall I go have you guys here? 
whilst I do it so you guys can get like a front view. I'm running so behind that I can't even try out the new products, but it's okay because I'm gonna do Zara tomorrow um, and then show you guys some of the pieces. But I found that like, but I realized that I showed you guys basically what I got in terms of clothes yesterday. Uh, my, th my three p pieces, the jacket, the sh uh, trainers and um, the jeans. And then I've just got some heels to show you and like, um, and then that's like, and then a two piece from, a two piece, two two pieces. Um, and then the, the tops I showed you guys as well, I got from Zara. So I basically show you guys everything. I'm like, oh yeah, channel, but I've got heels as well to show. So I'll do that, but yeah, it's not as exciting as I thought because I just showed you guys everything. Anyway. I'm rambling. I'm like running a bit low, so I'm having coke. Do you remember my Nollywood party? I've literally had like, like crates of coke, cans of coke um, since then. That was like last year, September. Anyway, yeah. I mean, it's not, it's not expired or anything. But I just had it and I was like, you know what? I need to get rid of it. And I was like, the best way to get rid of it is just drink it from time to time. So that's what I've been doing, or when like guests come, I just offer it to them. So yeah, it's taken a while to finish, but this is my last. You know what? It might not even be my last one because I've got like storage downstairs. It might not even be my last one. We cannot probably think or even, or even breathe. If you say you feel that feeling. Feeling. The one that makes it impossible for you to look away from them at any given moment. When your body and soul feel as if they could burst into flames whenever the two of you are near. I can only describe it better myself. Hmm. Boy, you know you love that woman. You do not love the younger sister. Hmm my battery died didn't realize it until i was like halfway well not halfway through but almost through i'll put you guys in my wardrobe um guys i don't really like my outfit today but it's because like i can't really wear heels yet so my outfits are like quite casual but i'm still trying to dress up okay i can't put you guys in my does this work yes it's very upsetting the top love it from zara um it's one of the tops i bought the top from Zara, I love it, and I'm wearing boa jeans. Um, what coat am I gonna wear? I think I need to look a little bit more dressed up. Oh, sorry babes. I'm gonna put a long coat. This coat is from Joseph, a brand called Joseph. Bottom of net of water. The way I have taped my boobs up. I don't want to wear, I couldn't really wear a bra, so you have to like, make sure they stay in one place. Um, I mean, yeah, I don't love my outfit, I want heels. I'll show you guys the full, actually, I can show you guys in the mirror. I don't like it. I don't like it. I ain't got time to even soak my boy, let me just put my bag on and get going. Um, I was going to put the neutral train, um, the neutral Jordans that I got, but <clears throat> if you saw the way I had to fight the other day when I was putting them on, not today, babes. What bag? What bag? What bag? What bag? Gonna go with this bag. Excuse my room, it's very messy. That's what you get for getting your content. Okay, let me put my bag on. I'll show you the way so. Oh, I'm wearing the YSL, actually. No. No, it goes better with my shoes. It goes better with my shoes. And I've already got everything I need in here. Okay, cool. That was simple and easy. Let's get going, babes. Off to see Nicole.
Good afternoon. Um, I have my bonnet like this because when I tell you the lace on this week, oh, I'm not in the mood to lay it down. I'm just gonna have it on my head. Um, I'm waiting for summer lunch. I've just been editing this vlog. It's Monday. I haven't spoken to you guys since I was going to out to eat with my friend Nicole. Um, if you don't know Nicole and I, we were um, housemates in uni, so. I haven't like seen her properly in a minute in a while. I graduated in 2019, a long time. Um, actually, no, she finished in 2018. I had to like redo basically a year <laughs> and then graduate. So yeah, it's been a, it's been a minute since you probably catched up. So that was really nice. We went to the bank. The food is so good. I remember when I went back in. 2018 I think I went with yeah I went with Avon and Tamara we didn't love it then we didn't love it but we did get there late but we didn't love the food but now the food the service everything amazing I can't wait to go back really really good in fact on the way to the dinner I was in my uber and the uber driver told him oh I'm going to the bank and the whole way there he was just talking to me how good it is because he was there from well he used to go there from the very beginning um, like seven years ago so he's seen it really grow but yeah really impressed anyway waiting for some food see we're into a new week this week is going to be busy uh, again hopefully i can really get back i feel like i'm back into vlogging and i really enjoy it again oh watching bridgerton haven't finished it i just kind of wa watch in and out i don't feel like it's a show you really need to binge um definitely love first season more than the second um, the storyline is giving very much scandal. I mean, um, Shonda Rhimes is like one of the writers who is also the same writer as Scandal. So same storylines, but I love it nonetheless. I love romance. I love a little rom-com. We don't get that more often. Well, it's not com comedy. It's like a, oh, that's my food. It's like a drama, like drama romance. I also uh, put in my Invisalign. Ah, oh, I'm so happy. I forced it last night and just had a really painful night. I didn't have any painkillers and just went through it. And um, it's still painful now, but it's nowhere near like when I first started. I just had to conquer the pain and then I got used to it because my teeth are always moving. Daddy! I have got to stop eating out. So what I usually get from Oaxaca is, I get some plantain tacos with feta cheese. I'm not a cheese person, but this tastes delicious. And then I also get grilled chicken and avocado tacos, which tastes amazing as well. And it's got a bit of onion. It tastes really, really good. And then I usually get this as a snack later, which is a vegan sweet potato. It's got black beans, rice, avocado, I believe. And it just tastes really, 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 really good. So I'll probably have that later on in the day. And then that is me done. Let me take off my retainers. <laughs> my teeth are sensitive from the Invisalign. So sometimes biting after freshly taken out Invisalign hurts. Mm -hmm. Amadeus, I still have some heels to show you and some other pieces. But I'm just going to wait. I'm sorry to be annoying. I'm gonna wait because I'm going away soon, quite soon. So I will show you guys the pieces in that vlog. When I think I want to do a beauty maintenance, skincare, all of that, beauty maintenance, shopping, all of that stuff. So, and I want to do it in due time, so I'm not rushing. I'm swearing to myself this year. I'm not doing any last minute packing. I really want to try to achieve everything a week before, so I'm not gallivanting like a lunatic day before my flight no 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 that was too good let's get the bill per oh no that was really good though Ooh, needed that anyway but yes this is the end of the vlog um, I really wish I could have showed you guys a little bit more and taken my camera with me. Um, but the places I go, it's just like, not really camera. So I try to get on my phone, uh, 
because camera qualities on iPhones have really improved. But anyway, we've got a busy week this week. I will bring you guys along. The busyness starts from tomorrow. So I'm going to edit this video, have it up for you guys. Um, let me know what you guys think. Comment down below. Subscribe for more. Um, once again, thank you to the 200k. Thank you to a whole bunch of new people, new faces. Um, the fam's getting bigger and bigger every day. So I'm so glad and thankful to you guys. And yeah, catch you guys in the next vlog. Mwah. Bye.